even Mars rover and space Wi-Fi, right? So for you, heaven's not above. It could be anywhere, right? You're not a flat earther, are you? No. Why would Why? you reject? Why? I is not. Come on, Jesse. Why do you reject the first page of Genesis? I saw you had a flat earther, Mark Sargent. He destroyed the guy in the debate. <laughs> I don't think you guys were listening. Is there no flat earthers here? Hold on, when is Christian this from? You don't believe the earth Nine months ago. Earth is flat? You <laughs> so believe you, in the moon landing? You, it's you, been debunked a million times. Let me tell you this. Don't I don't either believe it or don't believe it. It doesn't matter. Okay, well, I'll, I'll take that. But yeah, you know, it, the greatest uh, it does, though. It does, because it's a big lie and, uh, and everything is, you know, based on it including the climate agenda that is up ahead that is going to enslave the whole world it, it I, I think it does matter i really do think it does matter jesse the moon landing you it's you, been debunked a million times let me tell you this i neither believe it or don't believe it, it doesn't matter okay well i'll, I'll take that but yeah, you know the greatest matter. mind on the internet nick fuentes who beats everyone in the debate banned from every platform you guys are on his cozy millions of dollars he believes in the firmament if the greatest mind on the internet is a geocentrist how is it a funny position like dude he believe, you're, you're ascribing infinity to matter and space time the universe is infinite <laughs> where's the corner you're looking every picture of space is fake Do there's you, never been a picture of a curved earth it's a fisheye <laughs> camera warping lens or it's like with the google earth like that photoshop shit Dude, 120,000 feet in altitude. It's a motionless plane. Like Einstein said, the Earth is an observable, motionless plane. Horizon comes from the word horizontal, and the four wings of the Earth is in the Bible. All Abrahamic faiths and all religions were geocentric flat Earth. So have you always believed that Earth is flat? No, it was the 2016, uh, when the Trump administration leaked through the dark web that uh, all the flat Earth stuff, uh -huh. they didn't want people to believe in the Clinton establishment. Right. Like, oh my God, if the Earth is flat, they're lying to us. What did he say? And then they shut it down. The most Google topic and the most... Did he say that the Trump administration leaked the flat Earth thing on the dark web? What? Uh, when the Abrahamic faiths and all religions were geocentric flat Earth. So have you always believed that Earth is flat? No, it was the 2016 uh, when the Trump administration leaked through the dark web that uh, all the flat Earth stuff, uh -huh. they didn't want people to believe in the Clinton establishment right. like oh my god if the earth is flat they're lying to us about everything and then they shut it down the most google topic and the most so hold on i've never heard this but he's claiming trump etc is behind the flat earth movement interesting if that's true because if that's true because it was around 2015-16, I, I, I got to hear about that there was people actually believing in Flat Earth. I don't know. I don't know if that's true. But it's crazy if it is. Bad. Now they talk about a disc flying through space and stupid shit. It's ridiculous. But it is flat. No one's ever taken a picture of a curved Earth at any altitude. You look at the NASA Red Bull jump. Dude, Eric Dubé released a book. A lot. Yeah, 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 but that's not what I'm talking about. Around 2015-ish, Flat Earth became a thing. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, if we're going to go who wrote a book about Flat Earth, we could probably could go 500 years back. I'm talking about it became a thing around 2015-ish. Is that not true? Is all of Earth New Mexico? There's like no oceans? And it's at 100,000 feet, and then they said, yeah, we use the fisheye lens. They always admit it. They it means are Trump and Flat Earth in the same sentence and instantly. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to show my uh, wiener right now. I'll show it later, but not right now, because I'm hard right now, man. I'll show it when it's not hard. <laughs> Either say it's a composite fake image from NASA.com or a fisheye lens. They can never use a regular lens when going 120,000 feet in altitude, because the Earth, like Picard said, is Earth is flat with an upturned edge, which is the highest shoreline on Earth, Antarctica. Antarctic Treaty, longest treaty ever held. A compass, one magnetic north. There's no south pole on a compass. You circumnavigate east to west, like on a plate, like Christopher Columbus, like All the right. sun. The sun and the moon perfectly eclipsed because they're the same f***ing size. They are much smaller than the Earth. Amazing. The first page of Genesis. Amazing. I don't care. Amazing. I, I'm... <laughs> Talks about this. So when you, you believe that one side of the Earth was round, right? No, what the fuck? You never believed it round before you believed <laughs> that it was flat. Every single ancient cosmology, so, Egyptian, all of them oh, say okay, it's flat. So you never believed that it was round? I did up until 2016, until it became the most searched And why did you believe it was round? Because I learned it in high school. They so taught, you believe how they said it? They, they taught me that you guys believe in Planet X, 
right? And Nibiru and all those CGI photos and Europa. It's all computer. I'm like, my n they've never taken a picture of space that's not computer generated. How are people falling for this? Then I read 98% of the world's population has below average IQ, almost to a level. And I panic <laughs> because 98% of the Earth's population thinks they're on a spinning ball and it spins at the axis. Uh, at the angle is 66.6, .6, a Masonic number. They invert the devil's number. But when you look at it, it makes no sense because they say the atmosphere is not moving, right? It doesn't move with us with the Coriolis. That means a helicopter. If Jesse and Zerka got in a helicopter and floated for 10 hours, if it's a 24 hour cycle, we should be able to land in China. Yeah, yeah, but they got a bullshit excuse for that. They're like, yes, but inside of the atmosphere, everything appears to be the same. Like, everything is still still. Earth is spinning, but that inside of the atmosphere, everything is still. Some shit like that. When we land. But you land in the same fucking spot every single time. <laughs> and they try and lie and say, no, that's because the atmosphere moves with us. No, it doesn't. Are you fucking retarded? So let me ask, if you believe at one point that Earth <laughs> They have to say the atmosphere moves with the rotation. Because if they don't, the whole globe thing falls apart. I mean, it does anyways, but... You know what I mean? They have to come up with a bullshit excuse, like the atmosphere is following the car, uh, the rotation. Now, because someone <laughs> said it, right? Yeah. The now government you, said it. Right. And they well, get $100 million dollars a day for of tax revenue. Right, but who said you. it? And, now and you know what's funny? And all that, flat, Jesse, all flat earthers that do their own tests, they don't make money. 1,000 tests, it's flat at 120,000 feet in altitude. 1 million NASA tests, they made billions of dollars. Who the f are you going to trust? Clinton's government or me? What the so, f do I gain from saying it? And so why, me, why is triangle this. earth, hollow earth, why are those not the most searched? Because no one can defend them. If you say the earth's a triangle, there's no one who could sit here and debate that because it's just f***ing retarded, right? I would lose every debate. If you say the earth's a, square, uh, a cube, I can't debate that. You'd beat me with the scientific method. It, with every part of science, you'd beat me. If you say the Earth is flat, all airplane flight manuals say it's a non-rotating flat Earth. Just land the fucking plane. Don't kill anyone. And the autopilot uses an as a month equidistant flat Earth map with the ice wall that everyone makes fun of. Why would autopilot for emergency landings use our flat Earth map? And people are like, yeah, because it's like it, it has to be used. For Dude, they're changing the sizes of the continents when they're using this map by a lot. So how the fuck, imagine emergency landing on your Mercator or a globe or, you guys would all die. You have to use our map. We don't use your map for shit. So, your military, everything uses our map. This. So you believe The United that, Nations flag is the flat earth map. So you believe that earth was round at one time because someone said it at yeah. that time, right? Yeah. I used to believe gays are a thing too. Now you believe the earth is flat mm. because someone said it. Yeah. Right? It's supposed to someone. Well, no, no, no. It's what do you someone. mean gays are a thing? You don't think people are gay? Government said it's round. Right. Random dude who put a camera on a balloon he did the same test as nasa both of them won 120 one should... is a ball one is flat one makes 100 million in tax <laughs> revenue with the ball and think about it if it's a ball they attack the first page of genesis but, but my point if is you, you say, still believe jesse it. says i don't care jesse if you say you don't care about spreading flat earth you're saying you don't give a f about the first page of genesis Maybe. that's the worst position you can have and people are like why do you think it's the craziest position to have flat earth because they I could never believe the Bible when I was young because I said, those idiots thought the earth is flat. They were right. <laughs> Let me ask you this because of time here. So you believe, now you believe the earth is flat because somebody said it, right? Non-government. Non-government said yes. it. Non-profit. Right, said it. Yeah. What would happen if... No, no it's not said it. It's like I have seen stuff that proves it. You know what I mean? It's not just, oh, somebody said, hey... The earth is flat. Oh, is it? Okay, now I believe it. No. What? Um, government, none. Some guy riding on another camel mm -hmm. over in wherever. And they came and told you that the, the earth was circular or something. I'd say prove it. Would you, and then you would believe it? You'd have to prove it with a scientific okay. method at 120,000 feet at 8 inches per mile square curvature calculations. He would never be able to prove it. Does it concern you that you don't know for sure that it's only because somebody said it both oh, ways? I've already done the test. We oh, did a thousand dollars. Yes. Oh, okay. Mil like thousands of people have done this test. Do you think if you put a camera on a weather balloon at 100,000 100, feet, you're going to see a slight warping of the horizon? And it's not because it's just so big. The Earth is so big, you'll never see it. It's eight inches per mile square. The Earth is not even that big. We fly around it. You will see a fucking curve. Bro, they literally say that there's some scientists who said that the horizon warps and curves because of an illusion in our eye, and let we can never see it. Like, these guys let me, cope. Let me do this and because of time. Let before me do this. NASA was created in the 1960s, I'll post a link on my Twitter, all... Oh, scientific consensus was 
that the moon is not a rock. You can't land on it. It's cosmic plasma. That's why you can see stars through the moon. That's why you see blue sky through the moon. So the moon you, is translucent so and then transparent. And also, one more thing. You know, with the moon, I think me and the DJ discovered this or stumbled upon this uh, the other time. You know, uh, some say that the moon is a sphere. Let me see if I can find. Anyways, I can't find it. But some, the shadowing on the moon, it's not, it's not enough to, to make it look like a, a sphere. Uh, but, uh, oh yeah, let me, let me just say this. I always say this, but let me pull it up. What is a circle, right? A circle is just a, a line that is drawn from a center point to another point, and then you keep doing it, you know? What, what does that mean? There is no such thing as a circle. I mean, there is a thing that looks like a circle, sure, but there is no real circle because everything is made out of lines. And a line, A to B, is just a bunch of squares or dots, but dot is a square if you zoom in. It's a bunch of squares lined up from A to B, that makes a line. So there is really no curve ever. It's all made out of a line. Eat that, you globe tarts. Eat it! Eat it! No, that was, uh, what was that? Weird Al Frankovich. <laughs>